so coming to <coughs> the end of this challenge now. Um, it's Sunday. I went to bed because it was the Conor McGregor UFC MMA fight <coughs> and went to bed about, I think it was half seven, quarter to eight in the end uh, after watching all the panda trade and everything else because I'm based over in the UK. Um, so there's going to be other bits I'm going to summarise but I'm going to just get this bit done in regards to do with the weighing and I've got to try and work out all the, I know the days in one sense, but literally because I, I started on, let me just get this, because I'm late sometimes, I started my intermittent fast on the 7th, and then started weighing myself on the 8th, and literally I stopped my intermittent fast that was basically, well, what happened was probably about 7 o'clock or half 6 in the morning in the UK. Uh, well, I'd usually be still on my intermittent fast. I had a bowl of, I'd, I'd had two cups of tea, big bags of tea during the night, and then had a big bowl of um, cereal as well. So basically, like I just classed that as the end of the fast. So I thought, what I'll do is when I get up, I weigh myself. So I woke up probably about half eleven, twelve o'clock, laid down in bed, tried to sleep again, couldn't get back to sleep. Then watched some uh, YouTube stuff and then got up to spend obviously time with my family because I'm a human being, I'm a husband and a father, believe it or not. And I thought what I'd do is weigh myself. I've weighed myself already, but I'm just going to film it. So I was on the 13th, which is uh, the Sunday, 13th of November 2016, weighed in at 115.6, but I'm going to just film it now. I tried to poop, no poop come out, so <laughs> let's see if it's going to still be the same. So, just gonna switch it over to so do a switching. One moment. Okay, so that's me switching it over. Not using the best camera at all, but I just want to get this kind of done and dusted for you guys. So, far away in there. Okay. So now I weigh myself again, it's at 115.4. I'm gonna come off. Because this girl I'm gonna take it whatever I get it as now. Okay, because I always try to do a medium for the beats slightly off. I'm just gonna try to as my ingredients. Okay, so I'm gonna take it as 115.4. Okay, because I've actually got some shorts on now, which I didn't have before. Alright, so wow. So that works out to be that literally what I've done, I'm just looking away, I'm gonna get my thing, because so I've worked everything else out before. Uh, we'll have to kind of calibrate it slightly now. What I'll do is I'll turn the camera around. Well I'm gonna do it this way, so bear with me a minute. I'm extremely happy. So turned it around whilst I turned it around and everything else. I thought let me make some fresh recordings and everything else. So literally, I've done intermittent fasting for, let me explain this first, for six days, all right? Not even a week, for six days. And started on a Monday, then obviously recorded the weight on the Tuesday. But these are the amount of days I've done. Monday, Tuesday, so Monday the 7th, okay? November 2016. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and obviously one more equals Saturday. All right, so I'm not intermittent fasting today. So I've done six days worth of intermittent fasting, okay? All the recordings are obviously on all the films now. So this is gonna be day six, this recording, which works out to be right. Because it's a bit weird sometimes when you're trying to work it all out because you're starting this way and that way. You think, is that right, does it make sense? Okay, so my weight on the seventh uh, when I started was 118.7, okay? So that was on Monday the seventh. All right, um, and basically I hadn't, I was just doing recordings, and I thought, oh, well, let me start this, and then I just, I just started. Make, I made a decision like on the Tuesday, let's start doing this. And the weight today, which is the thirteenth, is one hundred and fifteen point four kilograms. All right, so once you kind of deduct everything from the the seventh and the thirteenth. Okay, you end up with 3.3 kilograms lost, 
which is awesome. That's like half a stone. I've got to change my hand over this, getting tired already. So it's like half a stone. Okay, awesome. And then, so you times 3.3 by 2.2, which is basically each key, each one kilo in comparison, in comparison to a, a pound is 2.2, okay? 2.2 uh, .2 pounds equals a kilo. So 3.3 kilograms times 2.2 equals um, 7 pounds, point, uh, 7.26 pounds, okay? And that's over six days. And like I said, I even ended that fast and I broke it in the middle of the night, stroke morning, I can't say night, in the morning, with cereal, <laughs> bowl of cereal, and I'd already had two big mugs of cup of tea with no sugar, it doesn't have sugar in it, just has uh, uh, almond, um, is it almond? I think, yeah, I think it's almond, like vanilla, I love it, almond vanilla milk, okay, and two big mugs of that, maybe even three if I don't remember, and a big bowl of cereal. Slept, pff, didn't have much sleep at all, probably about four or five hours sleep, been up since, and um, I didn't even sleep in the night either, so that's full sleep deprivation, major sleep deprivation as well. And altogether, I've lost 3.3 kilograms, aka 7.26 pounds. That is. And did I kill myself for that? No. Was I killed for that? No. I felt it a little bit on certain days. I won't lie. Certain days I was there being focused, but then what, what's happening is you, you're controlling your eating. Did I feel it in the gym at all? No. Oh yeah, also no gym today either. <laughs> oh my days, so no gym either. But I'm not really cal uh, out that day anyway. So basically, five days in the gym, one day off. Okay? In the gym, felt perfect. Seriously, I'm not even lying. Done what, all what I usually do. Some days I smashed certain parts, of other days I didn't and everything else. So all round, all in all, just feel I cannot class that in any shape or form as a killer. I'll tell you what was a killer, is getting the videos together, getting them up, all the brokenness, how the videos are broken out, and making sure I'm getting, them, getting all the information, and then getting all the data, and then conveying the data. That was more difficult than anything else. And I having to deal with the boiler situation that's going into this week as well. Do you see what I'm saying? That was difficult. The fast and the eat and everything else wasn't difficult. There's sometimes I suppress my thinking and say, okay, look, you're trying to get the most optimum for this. And it was all over the place as well. I was breaking my fast really late in the evenings as well during the weekdays. Even yesterday, I thought I was going to break it earlier. I ended up breaking it about four, half four. That's when I usually break it throughout the week. Throughout the week, that wasn't happening at all. Throughout the week, what was happening was I was breaking my fast at five, half five, six o'clock, sometimes really half six. So it wasn't a kind of a fasting, uh, intimate fasting, any shape or form that was at an optimum, optimum level, okay? 115.4, I am literally four kilos, or say five, sorry, not five kilos, five, uh, 500 grams, I don't know if it's 500 grams or five grams, forgive me, I don't even know, but away from being 114.9, I am going to be officially no longer obese in this coming week, but officially classed as overweight. I have not lived, experienced that. I don't even know how long for. I don't even know how long for. Because I know I was over, be, over I know that I was overweight definitely when I was uh, 23, 24. I don't think I was obese, but then I become obese probably when I was about probably 27, 28. <laughs> so I'm coming into some new grounds. So, attention, get focused. Find something that works for you, okay? At the end of the day, it's not all about uh, caloric deficits. I have to still explain about the foods and everything else. A lot of that is based on what I eat anyway, naturally and how I've been eating, and that's what part of my long period of program is, okay, with my calories. So I'll be going through to do the macros and so forth, probably this week, and go through some of the, some of the meals I ate, 
whilst I was uh, going through this fast. But I didn't do anything different from what I've been doing for basically the past, in the way of eating, in the past, um, I'd probably say six or seven months, definitely. Besides the binging bit, there was no binging going on. But I say that, there was, <laughs> there was yesterday, I, I, I smacked back half a, half a packet of monkey nuts. So 200 grams of monkey nuts I threw into that, into the mix. <laughs> as well as the bowl of cereal as well. So, there's going to be a whole lot of stuff that I'm going to talk about about this throughout the week now, okay? This is a small video just to give you a compression of, of the final analysis of how I felt. How I'm feeling right now, I'm feeling me, just bah! like I go nang. But I'm not going to do a long, long video. I'm going to spend time with my family. Sunday, I've got up late, I'm out of my bed and so forth. So just to revise the, the report again, 7th of, uh, of November, which is a Monday, 118.7, okay. Final weigh-in on the 13th, which is six days later, um, which is six days later in regards to doing what I'm going to be doing to do the weight loss. It's the seventh day, but I'm not in doing any intermittent fasting today, even though it, <laughs> the fact that once I've done this video, it'll be about half two. <laughs> I could just carry on, but I'm not going to. I'm going to start off afresh. After I get this week out, I've got a lot of things to do this week, and then I'm going to, I'm going to do another kind of uh, uh, intermittent fasting uh, and, and collate it all. But I ended up so 7th, Monday the 7th, 118.7, okay. Sunday the 13th, okay. I'm not going to do the rest, I'm not doing a, a seventh day. So this is, a, this is just a six day result. Including binge eating and and some cereal and some monkey nuts etc etc. One one five point four, which works out to be a grand total loss of three point three kilograms. Times that by um, two point two for the uh, to get the pounds, which works out to be seven point two six pounds. Okay, so that's it. Voila, salute. See you tomorrow. Keep on, keep it on. And just go do it already. Laters.